What is going on YouTube? It is September 2nd, 2016, the second week of the Alabama high school football season, and boy do we have some good games going on tonight. We're going to start off with Class 7A. The schools and the game of this week is, number one, McGill Tulin has going to play Murphy, who is the number five school in 7A, and this game is going to be at Lead Pebble Stadium. McGill Tulin, they almost lost last week in overtime to a team that they should have beaten by much, but they're going against a Murphy team who's going to give them a shot, but I believe McGill Tulin will pull out of this one and win by at least a touchdown or two. Then we go on to 6A. The matchup of this week is Baldwin County, who sits in at 2-0, versus Blount, who is 2-0, and and you know, Baldwin County, they have one or two good players that are coming back from injury. So I believe Baldwin County will be the winner of this match. Then we move on to 5A. It is Viger versus Citronelle. Uh, Viger is 0-2 in 5A, and Citronelle is coming in 1-0. Citronelle scored 71 points last week, but they are playing Viger this week and not a 1A McIntosh. I believe Viger is going to handle their own this week. Mac Citronelle will compete, but I believe Viger will win this game. Then we go to 4A. The matchup in this one is UMS Wright versus Escambia County. Uh, according to a few stories, UMS Wright has a big game next week against Andalusia, and this is just a step in the way. Watch out for Escambia County, though, because they can't upset them. But I believe UMS Wright will win by a touchdown or two over Escambia County. Going into 3A, the game this week is 2-0 Weaver versus 1-0 Walter Wellborn. And this is going to be a classic 3A matchup between these two teams. I do believe, though, Weaver will win this game. Expect to be close for the most part, though. Now we move on to 2A, where it is 1-0 Leroy versus 1-0 Washington County. These schools playing against each other. They've been playing against each other for a while. Uh, Leroy, they're kind of getting back in the swings of things of when they were winning a lot of football games. But Washington County, they're still going to be good this year, and they're going to be real good against Leroy. So I believe they'll win by at least 14 points in this one. Then we go to 1A. It is 1-0 Holy Spirit versus 1-0 Pickens County. Pickens County, Pickens County, excuse me, dropping down from 2A to 1A. They're getting into the ball of things, and I believe they will contain Holy Spirit and expect them to at least win either by close or by big in this one. Now we move on to the AISA matchup this week. It is between the Marengo Academy Longhorns versus the Monroe Academy Volunteers. And in this week, Marengo Academy, Marengo Academy won last week against Morgan Academy. Uh, Monroe, they lost their first game to Bessemer, and then they won the next week. Uh, I, you know, Between these two schools, they love to run the football, but Monroe, they have more power to their side, and I believe that they will beat Marengo by a few touchdowns. So that is this week's uh, Matty Ice predictions for the Alabama High School F Alabama high school football season, and let's see what's going to happen.